breaking travel news. Travel Talk with Phil Blizzard, talking to industry experts and decision makers. Travel Talk on breaking travel news. This occasion we're previewing the annual Arabian Hotel Investment Conference, which takes place in Dubai. Talking with Jonathan Worsley to get a preview of what we can expect this year at what the tenth event. Hard to believe it started in two thousand five. I know. It did ten years already, Phil. Yeah, amazing. Yeah. So, what's going to be the theme this time? Well, given it's our tenth year, we're going to be looking at uh, the current landscape and uh, yeah. a decade of hotel investment and trends ahead. What's going? What's what's on the, the if, landscape? You know, I think I've been to every single one. It started off a bit slow. Then there was a huge boost with so much investment opportunities and of course the crash came dropped off and things are picking up now by by all accounts exactly exactly you, you're absolutely right i mean our peak year for this conference when we had a thousand delegates was in 2008 mm. and um but this year really seems to be we're getting you know back on track in terms of interest from around the world and um and uh, yeah numbers yeah. are looking good for the event so as you say looking at the current landscape reflecting back a little bit and you're introducing a few new sessions and a few key new key topics. What can we expect this time? Um, we've got some fabulous uh, sessions going on this year, uh, and, and we're playing around with uh, present your project. So that's all about um, allowing delegates to um, uh, present their project if they've got an investment mm. that they want to present, f looking for operators okay. or indeed advisors, what have you. So. Yeah. Um, We've got uh, that session. Okay, well it's the Arabian Hotel Investment Conference looking at the Middle East and the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia is an important area uh, which has got projections of huge growth for, for tourism and hospitality. So what will be the aspect of KSA at this conference? Well outside of the, um, uh, the Emirates, um, Saudi Arabia is certainly our next biggest mm. uh, market um, in terms of delegates at the conference and we've been really working hard to uh, engage with the Saudi market so we now have briefings in Riyadh and Jeddah each year and, and we also um, and they're of course uh, one of our main sponsors as well at the conference so we're delighted to, to really engage with this community who are looking to invest in our in our sector. Mm. So present your project a new theme this year what else will be new and uh, you know perhaps you've got some trusted uh, favorites from other years coming along well we do we're putting on for the second time in a row the investors forum which jones lang lasalle are hosting okay. and that'll be just prior to the conference we'll have a hundred investors uh, that'll be attending that meeting it's a, it's a closed door session mm -hmm. and they then uh, attend the conference as well so you mentioned jones lang lasalle the investment so yeah. what else well, for the first time we've got a, a special meeting with the UNWTO and the WTTC, the World Travel and Tourism Council, and they're hosting a meeting with us, with the tourism ministers and the private sector closed door meeting. But I think it's very important for us to be engaging with the public sector and, and you know, looking at the issues facing uh, both public and private right. issues in our, in our space. One of the key aspects of the conference is the nomination or an award going to a key person from this industry and there's been some very notable names in the past from His Highness Sheikh Ahmed bin Said Al Maktoum to Gerald Lawless. Can you give us some indication who might be getting this big achievement in 2014? Yes indeed we've, um, we're delighted that we've got uh, His Royal Highness Prince Sultan who's uh, chairman of the Saudi Commission for Tourism mm. and Antiquities as our leadership award this year. Okay, and of course he's attended the conference in the past. I remember he has indeed, he has, he's been a great supporter. Okay, so the event as usual taking place at Madinat, which has been a, a very sort of loyal partner I suppose. In That's many right, ways. absolutely. And what is the date for, or dates for this year's event? It's uh, 4th to 5th of May, coming up soon. Okay, Jonathan, thanks very much. A preview there of the 2014, the 10th edition of the Arabian Hotel Investment Conference.